the burns have just about healed now, but we still need to monitor her for a while, make sure she's okay. I think she'll be an incredible pain. Yeah, it's like having the palms of your hands burnt off. Now she's had a second chance at life, it could have been a very different situation for this uh, koala as it has been for, for thousands and thousands of other koalas. So in November and December alone we had nearly three times the number of koalas that came through. Overall we saw the number of animals double, so we're currently getting just over 80 animals a day and so our ability to partner with people like WWF and raise money through the community is what keeps us going. We wouldn't be able to do the work we do and that would be a real tragedy for the animals. Well, I mean, this crisis has been devastating. We can't forget that as bad as these fires have been, there was already an extinction crisis. Koalas were already doing terrible across large parts of Eastern Australia.